you're doing something and you turn around and just see this cat standing and looking at you. Shy type, and he's pretty fearless. We've had Zippo for 10 years now. Taro we just got last year. He's a new addition to our family and Zippo's trying to keep up with him. <laughs> One is like one of the largest breeds, and one is like one of the smallest. When he's sleeping or when he's just walking by, I will like sneak attack him. <laughs> I don't think Zippo's in that playful phase anymore. <laughs> but Taro definitely keeps him busy. In our living room, there's like two chairs, and they'll each take a chair. Zippo will oftentimes pick a spot, and Taro will want to take his spot. He'll like <laughs> chase Zippo off the spot just so that he can sleep on that spot. Yeah. For no other reason, there's plenty of other soft places where he can sleep. <laughs> Whenever Zippo eats, Taro hears him eating, and he'll run over and want to eat at the same time. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why, Taro just wants to do whatever Zippo's doing. Zippo's very shy. He's very, very gentle. Taro's exactly the opposite. He's really fearless for his size. Go. He'll jump over everything and he'll climb anything. He'll chase Zippo around. He has a lot of energy. Taro's personality is so... Yeah. <laughs> he's such a baby. <laughs> Three. He's such a brat. Yeah. <laughs> he's always watched over Taro in a way. He'll come lick him when he's sleeping. He'll always keep a knife out for him. They're both babies. They're part of our family. <laughs>